you though, there was one the one time I broke where I was done. I had fought. Uh, it was my second time getting to go back to Pancrase, and I fought a gentleman. And his his record wasn't overly skilled. And I had watched a bunch of tapes the night before, and it was guys finishing fights. And, and again, you have to understand uh, excuse making, but to understand the story, we didn't spar back then. So you really did have to get in the ring on the few chances you could try and then, and try to put it all together. So I was watching these tapes in the, in the Tokyo hotel room of guys finishing fights. And I realized, okay, get on top and go, go all out. So the fight starts and I throw them down and I go all out and the ref doesn't stop it. So <laughs> I got, there's nothing left. I'm done. I'm all done. And I hang in there for the next 13 minutes of, of misery and they ended up raising his hand. And it was controversial. A lot of people thought I should have won because they did it like pride rules where it was one long fight, even though there was three rounds. And yeah. I was so dominant for those two minutes. And, and he wasn't overly dominant, but I offered no offense. And that's really all I remember is, is checking out early, hanging in, and just waiting for the bell to ring. And I was completely at peace when they rose his hand. It didn't upset me. It didn't bother me because I, I knew the I'm done. I walked right in the hallway. I sat down and I retired from the sport right there. And that was around 2003 off the wow. top of my head, but yes. And I was so at, at that point, Miguel. 